Hey everybody, it's Josh. I just want to get on here and make a video because I'm going to be uploading this Claude Trader agent to GitHub. Um, I'm posting it because it's doing what it's supposed to be doing. Since my last video, um, I've made a few changes in the way that it operates. When the script first turns on, it makes its market assessment and then it sends that info to the Claude agent. Now, on each update, it sends the previous setups that it found, and then it updates them based on the new bar's information. So now, instead of making a new assessment every time, we're constantly waiting to see what happens next and its assessment here even says we're going to continue to wait not ready to trade yet need to see if price resumes upward movement or if we get another pullback and that's for this window right up here the fair value gap trading bot this window is right over here in four minutes we'll get a new bar Let's so here is the behind the scenes for the clog trader. As stated, it uses historical data that I pull from Ninja Trader to operate all of these scripts. Um, it does the fair value gap analysis, the level detection, analyzes, it saves all your prior stuff. And Order so canceled. The fair value gap just made a trade. When you get this, I strongly suggest installing clock code. It just makes all of this, you can change it in any way that you want. Do not make any changes but I'm thinking about changing what the agent looks for So that's looking up all of that, but what you have to do in order to get it all to work is you have to use their API. And you get those from the Anthropics website. You purchase the credits and you get an API key that you then plug into the EMB file. I'm not going to show it because mine's in there, but when you get this from GitHub, you'll have a, where did it go, .env .example file. You will click on it, put it in your API key, and then rename the file, get rid of the example so that it appears just like that, and that's how the script will work. Three main factors to make trades, EMA trends. So right there, just off that short prompt, it has all this other stuff you can work with. And that's why I'm releasing it as is so that you guys can start making it your own. But this just updated. We, this is everything we sent to the agent, including the previous setups that we just looked at. It sends the closest gaps up and down. And then 
and right now the agent's working on it and we have a new update as before we were waiting to see if price would go up and now it recognized that price up But anyways, that is going to wrap it up for now. Um, I wish that it would have taken a trade. Let me see if I can. When it does get the signal, it writes it over to this CSV file, which is picked up by the Claude Trader script that I have running. Order submitted. And it put in a limit order to see if it will get picked up. Order submitted. And there is the 50 points. It's all set up to work off limit orders once the target is filled or the entry order is filled. Anyways, that's going to wrap it up for today's video. I will have the link in the description and stay tuned for more. If you haven't already, like and subscribe. It really helps grow the channel and get this out there to more people. Thanks. Bye.